Looks like I got hit by the hair. There we go. <laughs> okay. Um, hi guys. So we just had a little mini disaster that my computer has actually deleted somehow, I don't know how, but it's deleted all the videos that Tay and I recorded today <laughs> while we were out shopping. And I put it, I'd put all of it together and I had come, I came out here, filmed the conclusion, went back in and I went and the program had closed itself. So I reopened it, no worries, and then all of a sudden just everything had a question mark on it and I couldn't recover any of it. And then apparently all the videos that I'd saved into the file had gone and oh my god, it was... Oh, anyway, so, um, so you probably, so you don't have to watch Tay and I gradually die <laughs> throughout the day. Um, but, so I decided to turn this just into a, what we bought today, what, uh, what I bought today for the trip and all of that type of video. And I did, I did save one little part. Of the video uh, one part to show you guys we absolutely lost it in the middle of the op shop which was just crazy Tay mentions one thing and we just lose it the op shop is just the one place where god it's it's a surprise they do not kick us out anyway check this out Montgomery shirt. Say that. <laughs> I don't. Montgomery shirt. Nice Montgomery shirt. Montgomery shirt. Look at Australia. Read the yeah. bottom. No, read the bottom. The label at the bottom. Australiana. <laughs> don't think that's how you spell it. Why we are Australian? Because we're in fucking Australia. That's why. Um. Oh, I read that very wrong. <laughs> says the annuals of the word. The world. I took out an end and then thought that it's the annuals of the world. <laughs> Who would write a book about all the annuals in the world? This guy's an anal asshole. This guy's an anal asshole. This one just likes anal. This one's just into it but won't actually do it. This one likes watching it. <laughs> anyway, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm crying. That was just... I'm never going to stop laughing. Never going to stop laughing about it. That. But anyway... So, as I said before, <laughs> sorry, I just, uh, like every time I watch it, I cry as well. So, anyway, keeping that forever. So, I want, I decided today that I would show you my haul of everything that I bought. Um, so, I've got to get the bag. Okay, we have the bag that's over here, and then the other bags. That I sat there. So just give me a few seconds and we'll get those. So we'll start off with cotton on. So I wore these all day. I broke them in. They're really comfy. I've never had a disappointing pair of shoes from cotton on runners wise. And I actually have another pair over there somewhere of cotton um, runners from cotton on that I've actually gotten $10 <coughs> as well <coughs> excuse me so I got and we got absolute bargains with our shoes and as I said wore these all day so comfortable did not rub my feet at all I'm gonna wear them 
again tomorrow around just around the house to just break them in just that little bit more and then I think they'll be all good for Japan for three weeks of walking which will be all good so the next port of call was to get this thing so I hired it out from all goods camping shop outdoor shop in town so that worked out really well I got it for about hundred bucks so that was good not a whole lot in here just the shoes that I was wearing but I got this really cute tote bag when I got the runners so I was very happy with that it's like two two dollars extra so when they said oh it's all twelve dollars up and I was just like hang on wasn't the thing marked as 20 and they're like no over ten dollars oh okay that's my book for on the plane or one of the books that well the book that I'm reading after the current book that I'm reading which is the sixth Rangers Apprentice book but I also had this on a wish list on a website and I heard it was really really good so who knows and I might get a little bit of time while I'm while we're traveling you never know so the boys might go off somewhere and I'll be left by my, my lonesome to yeah. Um, one thing that I did buy, sing a little chew while you wait for me. Um, I, while we were sitting in the Kmart Plaza, I decided to get myself some new earphones. Um, I'm going to take these over as my spares, so because I have this feeling that the ones that I have currently, I'm going to get halfway through the trip and they're going to die, and it's going to absolutely suck. So. <laughs> I got some new new earphones today, so super thrilled with that. So when we went to Kmart, that was the biggest place that I wanted to go to. I hadn't been for a while and I wanted to get some accessories and bits and pieces. So the biggest thing I wanted to get was a to new toiletry bag and I got one that I absolutely love. It's got a very pretty pattern on it of all flowers and everything. And then when it's got a hook so you can hang it up but it folds out I absolutely love it and then it was and then it's just got a hook for when you have it hanging up this was only $12 I believe so it's got three compartments in it so I can hold and cuz I'm I wouldn't say I'm a girly girl but I'm a girl and girls need a lot of space so yeah, <laughs> let's just go with that. I needed a day bag for the trip, so I got this on special. So that was about the toiletry bag was about twelve dollars. This was on special, marked from nine dollars to seven dollars fifty. So I got a pretty good deal with that. So I can have my water bottle in it. I can have my phone. I can have everything in it for like day trips. And if we go shopping during the day and I find something that I want, I can chuck it in there. So no worries at all. Um, new, I got new socks. Uh, knowing my luck, I'm going to get over there with the socks that I've got and one or two pairs are actually going to die and I'm going to need backup. So I got new socks. They were only five bucks for a set of three, which was really cool. So they're the... Ultra, ultra low, so I grabbed them, thought that was fantastic. Uh, I got myself a new sports bra for over there, so I've got another two sports bras that I'm going to take over there. So I thought that was, I thought that was actually pretty cute, honestly. And I got it for six, only six dollars, um, even though it says twelve on the tag. Got it for six and I so I've got three sports bras and I can have three everyday bras. So works out really, really well for me. Um for shaving, I'm just got a little compact personal shaver. Yes, it's the same on both sides, I've just realised that. <laughs> so I thought that would be that would be fun. Takes triple A batteries. Actually, let's open it up while I'm so let's call this also an unboxing. Bring it in. Oh, nice. So just... So it's very, very basic. So that's really cute. Little and cute. Because why not? And what is it? Okay. 
Hang on a second, this should be fun. Sorry. Ah. So I'm guessing. Hang on. Travel ready comb attachment. Ah, that's what it is. Okay. So I'll be playing around with this tomorrow when I actually get the batteries. I might even see if anyone's got it, but that's pretty good. Okay. When I'm actually not filming, I will read the instructions. Okay. <laughs> I just don't, I don't really want you guys sitting there just going, "Why is she reading the instructions?" Well, she's filming. But anyway, I get I see instructions and I. So that's that. So I've wanted one of these for a little bit because it's a hassle to take my um, to take my razors and my shaving cream with me, and especially don't take it overseas. Just get yourself a little thing like this, and yeah, and that's the other thing I'm gonna have to. Oh, I just realised it did that. New little new toy to play with. Anyway, before I get even more distracted, um, nearly finished up my other diary, and my pens are getting low. So I got myself a new diary and new pen, new ballpoint pens to write down all of my adventures and everything. I am such a journal person. It's fan. I actually really love it. Um, so really, really helps me to relax so oh god I've made a bit of a mess here that doesn't matter I'll get there in the end all right so the last thing I'll show you guys and then I'm getting quite tired actually it's been a very big day I was up at nine something spamming Tay trying to get her out of bed she forgot that we were meeting at 10 she thought, she was like, why are we meeting at 10? And I said, because I got no idea what time I'm going to be. Anyway, oh good, I thought this needed to be washed, but apparently not. So, I got some nice tops, so I got that top. This is from, these are all from Salvos, because um, honestly, I go clothes shopping, and I only go to sales, pretty much, but otherwise, I go to an op shop. So, I got this beautiful little singlet top, and anything like... A lot of summer stuff, it's more going to be over there. So, I got that top. Uh, I'm still not sure about this one, but I think that's pretty, pretty cute, honestly. It's just got like little, little patterns on it. Really cute, but anyway, I got that. So, I got all these pretty cheap as well. Uh... Really wasn't sure about this top, and honestly, I'm still trying to figure it out. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out. Someone's chopped the tag out. So that explains. Oh, no, hang on. That might be. That might be the way. I don't know. But anyway, so either way, that's a nice, another little summer top that I can wear. And also, like, once, when we come back and all of that, like, it's still going to be midwinter, but at least I'll still have some... Other clothes for summer when when summer eventually throws around. Not sure if I'll take this with me, but I still thought that was pretty pretty cute. It's R. M. Williams. R. M. Williams shirt might be a bit heavy for Japan, honestly. But I'll make that formal decision tomorrow during packing. And last but not least, I thought maybe if it might get a little. I might just have that on occasionally. I don't know. You never know. It's cute either way. So whether or not I take it or not, I've still acquired a new a new top regardless. Um, that's everything from the Salvos. So my whole shopping is that. And that pile. So that was... That was shopping today, which was really... Which was a lot of fun. And... Although by the end of the end of the day, as I'll say this, I'll actually pack up my stuff. By the end of today, both Tay and I were buggered, and I had to go to 
Joseph's grandparents for pizza night and all of that sort of stuff. And I went and at the same time I sat there just going, sleep, sleep, over now. <laughs> I say sleep and I yawn. Great timing, great timing. Anyway, but like, um, so what I'm thinking about doing for the rest of the night is finishing up my vlog, uh, the vlog video to, I just got to do a couple more things to it, which is good. And go, I want to have a shower and then I just want to have a sit and watch an episode of something on Netflix. I started watching this really weird show called Crazy Ex-Girlfriend. Last night, and oh my god, it's weird, but it's funny weird, if you know what I mean. So, yeah, so that was um, quite okay, I think I've fallen that off, but anyway. So that was quite entertaining, but then I ended up just going to bed and listening to my audio book and then going to sleep. So, which one of the things I was a bit disappointed with, this book is on Audible, they haven't got the actual audio yet but that's okay it'll just be nice every now and again just to have a sit and have a read for god's sake i mean even jack's bringing a book he's just got to find one uh, so uh tomorrow is my last day in australia for three weeks so the plan is that um tay's coming around with gizmo again Years are probably getting a bit sick of her, but I'm sorry. She puts up with me so much better than my partner does a lot. Anyway, so she's coming around in the morning. We're going to get some odd jobs done around the house and get some of my stuff organised packing-wise. And then my friend Imogen is coming around for a few hours. Um, we're, and we are going to film tomorrow, so one more video before I leave will be uploaded for your enjoyment. So I thought that would be a nice little tidbit for you. But looking at my camera, I have actually now been filming for 15 minutes. So so I'm not talking your ear off my riddle, my lovelies. I am gonna sign off. I'm gonna go and have a nice hot shower, finish editing my video, and then I'm going to snuggle up on the couch with a show off Netflix and just have a bit of a chill before I have to go to bed. And then I've got to get up and I've got to do some more work. I might even actually do a load of washing and just put it in front of the heater. And I'm thinking about it. But anyway, all right, my lovelies. Well, thank you for joining me on this glorious shopping day. I hope you will enjoy it. Um, if, as always, if you have any uh, future videos that you would like me to film for when I get back from Japan, please don't hesitate to comment down below and say what those videos are. It'll be very helpful to me. Sometimes I can't remember for the life. I can't think for the life of me what I'm going to what I'm going to film next. So it'll help me out a lot. So until next time, my lovelies, or more um, more to the point. More um until tomorrow, my lovelies. Bye bye bye. Mwah.